If you're at risk for Alzheimer's, what if you could find out if you were at risk of it, would you take that test? Well, 10 News reporter Jessica Chen talked to doctors today who say that information can either help or hurt you. There were signs. She started to forget how to do her crossword puzzles, and it was this red flag for us that something was going on with her. At just 50 years old, Michelle Hanneman's mom was diagnosed with early onset Alzheimer's. The responsibility on the family members is really significant. For 15 years, her mother battled the disease. You really do see your mom go from being someone that took care of you to really being somebody that you have to take care of her. Michelle says she doesn't want her family, her kids, to go through what she went through. It's why she's considering testing to see if she carries the genes for the disease. I would set up my life in such a way where there would be answers already in place. They would know exactly what to do. But doctors warn it may not be for everyone. That what if you find out that there's a risk and it disables you, it upsets you, it creates anxiety. It's what could happen to many people who test. But Dr. William Mobley, professor of neuroscience at UC San Diego, says for some, that info is important. Time to become more aware of it, change your lifestyle, prepare for it perhaps. Michelle says for her, knowledge is power. We didn't know what it was early on with my mom. You know, it was so confusing. I don't ever want my family to have to go through that same type of confusion. In Claremont, Jessica Chen, 10 News. Having been through that myself and my family, I would agree. Pros and cons, but if you're interested in this testing for Alzheimer's genes, you should talk to your doctor about it.